This is a short history on Vincent van Gogh by John Aaron, called Vincent van Agogo. Please see me after the lecture if you have any questions. Vincent van, Chevy van, Nissan van, Jean-Claude van Damme, hot damn, there ain't no like van Gogh. He hung out in the cafes at Arles at night, slurping absent till he got tight, seeing things in a different light. No wonder he made sunflowers so bright. Painted weird flowers I didn't understand. Things he could have done with a spray can, spray can, spray can, spray can, go man van go. All the other artists, they thought he was weird with those crazy colors and that wild beard. They thought he was a bit of a loon in the mistral winds at high noon. Hey Vince, there goes your painting. What are you doing fainting? Is that technique called the sunstroke? Oh, sorry, that's a joke. Is that your brush with fame or are the critics lame? Hey, Theo, get him a poster deal. Dr. Gachet, he was crazy anyway. He made self-mutilation popular. Someone had to go call a copula. By then it was too late to stop you. Sacre bleu, someone go get a mopula. Perhaps if he'd stayed a little longer in Arles, he could have painted little landscapes with Prince Charles. But Chuck would have found him boorish and rude, and Vince would have slugged him and got sued. Sold one painting, that was all. Now they line museum halls. Only one painting while he was alive, but the last one went for 82.5. You know, that's a little funny, because that's twice the amount of money we gave Nicaragua at the start of Desert Storm. What, you didn't know? We didn't mean any harm. What do you think Vince would have done with that sort of jack? Have a heart attack? If I eat paint, will they make me a saint, or think I'm just quaint, or gay, or straight? I think he was a little hard of hearing.